total scumbag Jim Jordan's in serious shite, and you're not going to believe why. The Supreme Court, yeah, that collection of corrupt hacks, right-wing nuts, has just decided a case can go forward by 230 students at Ohio State from when Jim Jordan was a wrestling coach there, who've accused the university of ignoring sexual assault by one of the team doctors. Here's more on that. Ohio Congressman Jim Jordan continues to deny allegations that he turned a blind eye to sexual abuse while working as a wrestling coach at Ohio State University. In April, Ohio State revealed that it was investigating accusations that the now deceased Dr. Richard Strauss abused male athletes from 14 different sports. On Tuesday, two former Ohio State wrestlers told NBC that Jordan knew that the doctor was abusing members of the wrestling team he coached. Jordan, a two-time NCAA wrestling champion, told reporters Wednesday that he never saw or heard about any abuse while working at Ohio State in the late 80s and 90s. We knew of no abuse, never heard of abuse. If we had, we'd have, we'd have reported it. Yeah, you know, knew, knew uh, the doctor. Um, but there is no truth to the fact that that I knew of any abuse. Uh, or I've talked to other coaches. They didn't know of any abuse. Um, it just, they're just, it, that's just not accurate to say those things, that we knew of it and didn't report it. It's just not true. Well, if there's anything you know about old Jimmy Boy, it's that he's a liar. He often is hard to understand because he sounds like he's been sucking on a helium balloon when he talks. But the real thing about Jim Jordan is he lies about everything. Weaponization of government and says Trump is innocent of this and that. And it doesn't really matter. He's a right-wing hack who will lie about anything to help his party. So would it shock you he'd lie about anything to protect himself? That's the situation we have with Ohio State because numerous wrestlers have come out and said he knew exactly what was going on. This is disgusting. You people have the power to do something. Jim Jordan called me crying, crying, groveling on the 4th of July, begging me to go against my brother, begging me, crying for a half hour. That's the kind of cover-ups going on there. Now, you guys can sit and act like it's not going on, but I, I got a, a lot of other stuff here. Emails that were taken out of my mailbox, that's a crime. Now you saw a CBS clip earlier where they said two students came forward and said Jim knew what was going on. We've seen that team captain testify that he called him crying and begging, which seems exactly like something this pathetic loser would do. But it turns out there's six wrestlers have come forward in a newer piece that's been written. And there's a referee who claims that this Dr. Richard Strauss masturbated in front of him in a shower. He went and he told Jim about it, and Jim laughed it off, shrugged. Oh, that's just Richard Strauss. No big deal. Yes, the same guy who has turned Congress upside down, the same guy who will do anything, including overturning our Constitution to get what he wants, is a guy who will let wrestlers be molested and ignore it, according to numerous wrestlers and a referee. I know that'll shock you. If you can see above me, here in Ohio, we've got some storm clouds some storm clouds coming for Jim Jordan, too, and it's well past time.